my left hand rod that you would have seen me just cast in is on a 12 mil white fruit and nut pop up and then my right hand rod which is over towards the far reeds is on a white fruit and nut magic beans the 12 mil i'm at my local syndicate uh, that i joined last year quick day session get a video put out and then obviously get on to that bait giveaway for everyone been a good few hours now since I last spoke. Nothing much has happened on the lake. Out of the three of us that are on, no runs as of yet. Um, and the temperature has actually dropped a few degrees as well, so that's not going to help matters. But it's still early enough yet. I'm here for at least probably another four or five hours. So hopefully I can bag a cart before I have to go. But right, see you in, guys. The sun is dropping out the skies and it's pretty much at the end of the day now. Unfortunately, nothing, no one's had anything. Uh, there's three of us on today and not one of us has had a run. This lake, it's notorious for the carp not showing. It can be tricky at times, even in the summer. A lot of people do fish to the lily pads. Obviously the lily pads aren't up at the moment because obviously we're in winter my mate had his bait boat out with his sonar and he couldn't get any dings off any carp located because this is the thousand subscriber special i'm gonna do a collage of some of the better carp and better fish that i've had um, since i've made this channel over i think the last three years after that what i'll do i'll jump into the bait giveaway and what you need to do to enter it and what the prizes are. And I'm here with South Coast Angler. Hello. You spend all your time at these syndicates looking for the 30s and the 20s. Maybe 40s. And uh, you come down here, think you're going to walk over all these pasties, all the small fish, just full of them, you know. And, uh... <laughs> right, guys, that left hand rod's ripped off again down that channel producing this lovely little 12 pound, two ounce stocky. Left hand rod's ripped off yet again. The one on white fruit and nut, producing this lovely 16 pound on the nose common carp. My left hand rod that was on 13 wraps out on a gravel bar is absolutely melted off, producing this lovely 17 pound, two ounce lovely common carp. Absolutely perfect condition. Pound, what has it got? Well, one pound 10. One pound 10. Uh, a bit of fish melted off only 10 minutes scott's already had two i'll try to get them in the video and i'm in but not a bad start guys see them in all right guys so my left hand rod's absolutely rattled off producing this lovely scaly 26 pound two oh this 26 pound two mirror right hand rod that was on them lily pads has rattled off producing this stunning 17 pound 10 ounce lovely scaly mirror the rod's ripped off, producing this 22 pound one ounce PB common. So that left hand rod's literally gone after, I've chucked it back out. Can't believe this, that left hand rod that's on fruit and nut, uh, it's gone off again. I thought it was a little bit bigger, but lovely 14 pound mirror. It's a bit lively this one, to give me a sec. A lovely lovely scale patterns on him but yeah lovely little mirror but i can't even believe it my rod screamed off this morning i had to shout at scott massive fight resulting in this absolutely epic 20 what was it scott in the end 26 pound five 26 five uh... and there's another one rod's just gone off after that last one a bit ago Probably about a couple of hours, it's been a bit slow with the weather, but this one's got one nine, smallest of the day. Scott's still leading, and literally 20 minutes after that last one, uh, that left hand rod's gone again on fruit and nut pop up, producing this lovely 11 pound, uh, what was it, 11 pound, five ounce common. So there we go, guys, my right hand rod's ripped off uh, the one that was on 12 mil fruit and nut, producing this epic 18 pound uh, five which is my personal best for lake of tranquility so i'm over the moon with it a lovely little six pound two ounce bream to save what possibly could have been a 48 hour blank 
and it's all down to Stu recommending the move. So cheers, Stu. It's all right, mate. Fell down to the uh, Parker Bait wafter. My right hand rod after recasting. It was in 20 minutes on 12 mil white fruit and nut. Pretty much where Charlie's been for the last, how long Charlie? 36 hours? Yeah, but maybe a bit longer. Yeah, I thought I'd give it a go over there. Like I say, felt a clear patch. And like I say, 20 minutes later, resulting in this 17 pound, three ounce, lovely mirror. Pineapple pop up on the left in that channel has screened off to a nice little 12 pound two. Right guys, my right hand rod's ripped off. Producing this probably, I don't know, probably £12, £13, give or take. Lovely little scaly mirror. Right, guys and girls, so for the bait giveaway, only three things you have to do to be entered. You've got to be a subscriber. I will be checking. If you can like the video, and also in the comments section, if you can comment your favourite carp, I would have just done a collage of some of the better carp I've had. If you put your favourite carp or your favourite video I've done uh, on the channel, uh, that way I know who's entered put you in the database and then obviously I can pick the winners. Right, on with the prizes. Right guys, so what I thought I'd do, I didn't want to just do like one bundle for a winner. I like giving as much as I can to my viewers. You've helped this channel grow, so I want to give back as much as I can. So what I've done, I've done three uh, three prize winners. Uh, first prize uh, will be a fruit and nut bundle kind of thing. So. I'm going to chuck in a fruit and nut bait spray. With that, I've put in the fruit and nut matcha hatch wafters. So they'll be in with that. I've put the fruit and nut magic beans in. They're the 14 mil ones. Also with that, I've done, because uh, I had a few spare pots, I've done a bit of a combination uh, of the fruit and nut pop-ups in white. I've put in the 14 mils and the 12 mils, so that'll go in with that bundle as well. And then same, th similar thing, fruit and nut pop-ups, the matcha hatch ones, but the 14 mils. So all that will be for the first prize. For my second place uh, prize support, I'm gonna do the OG Fish variant of that. So the OG Fish bait spray. With that as well, the Magic Beans, OG fish, the 14 mils. Again, what I've done, I've put in the OG fish pop-ups. What I've done in there, there's a mix of 14 mil and 12 mil matcha hatch. So that's going in with them. And then what I've also got is a pot of OG fish pop-ups, the whites. They're in 14 mil. And I've also chucked in some spare OG fish uh, white pop-ups but the 12 mil variants of them had a half a tub so I thought I'd chuck them in with that as well so that's the second place and for the third place I thought I'd do a true pick a mix of all our flavours so what I've done is a pineapple flora pop-ups so half a tub of them uh, they've been glugged now for about three months so they're perfect as we're coming into spring also with that I'm going to chuck in a tub of the Magic Bean Wafters, the fruit and nut variants in 12 mil. So again, perfect floras. Um, with this, this is a proper pick and mix. OG fish pop-ups, but I've not just put in whites. I've got whites, pinks, match the hatch, all of them in 12. And some of the match the hatch are in 14 mil. So as I say, yeah, white, pinks and match the hatch. And also some OG fruit and nut white pop-ups in 12 mil. And on top of that, Ben Parker sent me a couple of signed stickers. Bosh.